Hey everyone, this is Joey back again at ESC Plus. Where we are continuing with our ESC Plus awards and next up is going to be best live performance. So the way I, I um, interpret this category is really trying to focus on uh, the vocals and the, the stage presence and the emotion that the artist gave that really might have elevated the song from the recorded track. And you know, it's kind of hard because it's kind of hard to dissect the, just the live performance out of all the different facets of somebody's performance, but that's how I'm interpreting it. So the way I say, um, based on that, here's who I'm giving my nominations to. One would be Zena at Belarus, just because this song jumped out at me after hearing her live. I really felt like this, she really elevated what seemed like a pretty simple kind of basic song to a whole nother level. Like it was much, much more engaging and much more energetic than I would have thought given the uh, studio track. So great job to Zena. Um, second would be the jury winner Tam Tamara from North Macedonia. I think everyone agrees that this live performance is what made North Macedonia have such a great result. It was all about the emotion and, and the vocal clarity and the, and the actual, the just, ability that she has to really bring the story and the emotion into her voice. Um, next up would be John Lundvik from Sweden, only because John has really been been like singing this song all the way through Melody Festival in and just every single time he goes out there, it's perfect. And I just felt like what he brought to Tel Aviv was he really integrated the mamas a little bit more and it was just, again, just a 10 out of 10 for me on the performance part, absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's really hard not to like John Lundvik, uh, so I'll give him that. Uh, then next up I would say Norway. All right, our friends from Norway, Tom, Alex, and Fred. I think I have to give this performance a lot of credit because the three of them were kind of put together to form this group to perform in Eurovision and they brought the energy, they brought the charisma, and, and Fred with his uh, yoking and, and and just have the timing of the three of them being in different places and just felt like I knew they had performed the song so many times that they would normally have it perfect just from practice, but it felt like it was even better than that. Like it was just so good. So definitely saying, consider Norway. Um, and then finally, I say Serbia because Novina just knocked it out of the park with the vocals. It was so touching. Um, the the, the lyrics that she was singing in Serbian were beautiful and I just loved the vocal um, so much. I thought it was a really classy moment of the evening at the, in the final, it was towards the end. So it was a really nice way to wrap up the, uh, the evening um, before we got the results. So um, those are my live performance nominees. Make sure you head on over to vote. Make sure you click like, share, and subscribe this video. So it'll be back to us when we have the winners. Thanks for watching.